Uh, today's flight was certainly uh, the roughest that I've been on in my six years of doing this. The, I guess the, the two things that really stood out for me just from you know, the perspective of, of flying through the storm, number one was the amount of turbulence that we encountered. That was the most that I had ever seen in six years of doing this. And I've flown a lot of major hurricanes over the last few years, Irma, Maria, Harvey, Laura. Um, and the other thing was lightning. Uh, just tons of lightning, especially in and around the eyewall of the storm, which is something that you really just don't see all that often. Hold! And also in that video, you know, I'm trying to hold it up to show the, um, the flight level data that we're recording. So the winds that we're um, recording, what track we're actually taking in relation to those winds. Um, there's also the radar screen there that kind of shows what we're flying through as far as um, the intensity of the storm is concerned. And we're watching the radars and this, we're, as we're going through the eye wall, which is the roughest part of the storm, it just seems to kind of go on forever and uh, you know, a lot longer transit through the eye wall than we would normally expect on a storm of pilots and flight engineers and meteorologists and technicians, engineers like me, uh, scientists on board, all these people doing their job with such uh, expertise and such dedication that any sort of concern you have for, are we really gonna make it through this? That all kind of melts away. There goes the beds, holy cow. coming out of this. 